Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to the incredibly talented artist, Pedermork Monsted. Born in 1859, Monsted hails from the beautiful country of Denmark. Growing up in a small town, he developed a deep appreciation for nature and the wonders of the world around him. These early experiences undoubtedly influenced his later artwork, as we can see in his magnificent painting Bedouins in an Egyptian landscape, created in 1893. This piece captures the essence of the exotic, with vibrant colors and intricate details that transport us to a faraway land. In his 1888 painting A View of Anacapri, Monstered gives us a glimpse of the stunning Italian town perched atop a cliff. With his keen eye for composition, he brings the viewer into the scene, allowing us to feel the warmth of the Mediterranean sun on our skin. Another masterpiece from that same year is View of Monte Carlo Bay. Here, Monsted captures the breathtaking beauty of the French Riviera, with its azure waters and lush green hills. We can almost hear the distant sound of laughter and the clinking of glasses as we take in this idyllic scene. Moving on to 1890, we have garden party with an elegant woman in a red dress sitting at a coffee table. In this painting, Monsted not only showcases his talent for depicting landscapes but also his ability to capture the elegance and sophistication of his subjects. The woman in the red dress exudes grace and charm, making us long to be part of this glamorous gathering. Fast forward to 1893, and we find ourselves immersed in the beauty of a twilight landscape. Monsted's use of light and shadow creates a mesmerizing ambience, drawing us into the tranquility of the scene. It's as if time stands still, and we are able to witness nature's serene beauty in its purest form. In the Royal Gardens, Athens, created between 1892 and 1893, Monsted takes us on a journey to Greece, where we are greeted by the majestic architecture and lush foliage of the Royal Gardens. Monumental yet serene, this painting captures the essence of Greek heritage and invites us to explore the rich history that lies within. Spring Landscape from 1893 showcases Monsted's ability to breathe life into the canvas. The vibrant colors and delicate brush strokes bring forth the joys of spring and evoke a sense of renewal and growth. In a stream in the forests of Mosgard, Denmark, painted in 1888, Monsted pays homage to his homeland. The peacefulness of the forest and the gentle babbling of the stream transport us to the heart of Denmark, allowing us to connect with nature through his art. Lastly, we have coastal scenery and King George I of Greece, both painted in 1892. These paintings demonstrate Monsted's versatility as an artist, as he effortlessly transitions from the picturesque coast to a regal portrait. Both pieces showcase his mastery of capturing the intricacies of his subjects and the surrounding environment. Pedder Mork Monsted's art is a testament to the power of observation and his unwavering love for nature and beauty. His life experiences, shaped by his surroundings and travels, greatly influenced his work, resulting in masterpieces that continue to captivate and inspire us to this day.